Hi everyone and welcome to a very special video. So this video is going to include a very special toy hunt that I did today. But first I'd like to tell you a little story. So like many of you, I have been obsessed with this Goldberg Elite ring that is due out. And I've been watching all the toy reviews, unboxings from America. And I've just been like, I need it, I need it, I need it. But I just could not justify spending a hundred pounds on it. But then I received an email last week that I thought would change everything. A special £10 off for every £50 that you spend in Smith's in store. So I jumped onto Twitter and I started tweeting Smiths. Normally they're pretty good and they'll kind of get back to me quite regularly. But unfortunately they came back with the news that I didn't want to hear that it wasn't going to be in stock until after the offer had expired. So despite that I kept on checking online but eventually I just kind of lost all hope. So fast forward today and it is my son's birthday and what he wants to do more than anything is he wants to go on a massive toy hunt. So we get in the car and off we go ready to kind of do this toy hunt and film it for his channel. It's my birthday at Fassie Smith's. So we arrive at Smith's and he is really, really excited. We're going to go look at the Pokemon section because that's what he is most into at the minute, despite me trying to get him into more wrestling figures. And we're down there and what do I see but Goldberg staring at me from down the aisle. So I literally sprinted down the aisle. I could have given Usain Bolt a run for his money. My wife, my kids, they're wondering, what is he doing? Why is he running down the aisle, sprinting past people? And I scooped up the box as quickly as I could and chucked it into the trolley. So then I started to compose myself a little. Now that I'd got a Goldberg and ring into my trolley and I started to have a look at the box. Now this box was absolutely battered. There were torn edges, it was all scuffed. So I thought, okay then, if I need to, I'll get this one, but I'm just gonna go and check. So I wander off, back down the aisle, move some of the other wrestling rings, uh, the scale ring, the money in the bank placer, and I find another one, much better condition. So I quickly swap them over and stick it into my trolley. I am now absolutely buzzing because everywhere I look there are £10 for every £50 spent at Smith's and I'm thinking yes I'm no longer paying £100 for this set it is now just £80 and I think yeah now that is a price I can justify paying so we go off the rest of the day spent um, filming various videos and kind of skits for my son's channel and I've just got the biggest smile on my face possible. Literally cannot wait to get home to open up this set. Now all the videos that I've seen like you've probably seen in America absolutely raving eye over this box. I made sure I checked that the lights were working and they do look absolutely awesome. I was a little bit worried there was going to be a dud one in there that I'd seen but thought you know what we'll just go for it and there he is the man who was staring at me going this toy is next as I was sprinting off the aisle. Love the um, back of the box the art everything like that all the pictures look amazing and it just filled me with so much excitement. So then I started taking out all of the pieces one by one. You can see all the various bits out here. Quite a lot of bits you have to put together, but the instructions may look quite simple. So click all these pieces into place and then kind of flip that over, add on the ring posts. 
Now the raw signs, they're a little bit fiddly to kind of put in and especially the apron put in around the little ends onto there but it went quite well and then you had to put in those uh, outside edges they were a bit fiddly and the moment that I was really dreading do all of the posts work <laughs> So, final thoughts, is it expensive? Yes. Is it worth it? That's probably debatable, but with that £20 off, if you can head to Smith's and you can pick it up in your local store, then I would definitely recommend getting this set. Now, the biggest point in kind of hesitation for me about buying this was those ring ropes. So I was kind of arming and ahhing about it and I was looking at all the videos, looking at all the photos online of the ring and just kind of seeing, thinking, is it that big an issue? In the end, I just went, you know what, I'm just going to go and buy it. So I've just put in this kind of picture here of one of the basic rings and you can see that the rope height is pretty much the same as the new elite scale which is annoying but it's not lower than the basic rings so in the end i thought you know what for all of the other features the fact that it lights up and everything this was just a must have purchase and just to finish i have zero regrets in buying this my bank balance maybe does but me personally i absolutely love it and i think it looks amazing um, and i cannot wait to kind of take more and more photos of this ring i actually prefer the size and everything because i think the figures got a little bit lost in the older ring and i can't wait to make lots of matches lots of photography and share it here on youtube twitter and instagram Okay, thanks for watching. Bye.